was about 10 or 11, that was the first time I met Johnny Cash. And him and Dad showed up, and when they hit that door, they hit it like pinballs. They were bouncing off the walls. I thought they were just nervous. Nobody took as many pills as Waylon. Nobody could, except maybe Johnny Cash. Waylon and Johnny Cash got an apartment together, and uh, Johnny would try to make breakfast with uh, that black suit on and making biscuits, <laughs> flour all over everything. They were both taking a lot of pills and trying to hide it from one another. Cash ran out one time, and Dad had just got enough money to buy him a new Cadillac. And Cash just knew that he had some pills hidden in the glove box or in behind the whole dashboard. And he went out there and didn't have keys or nothing, tore into the car, tore that side of the console completely out. He thought there was pills in there, but there wasn't. <laughs> I told Waylon a good place to hide them, and that's to take the light switch out and drop them down the, the wall. So he did that, and he'd come back to me later, and he said, well, how do I get them out? I said, well, you got to knock a hole in the wall down at the bottom. <laughs> when you really want them, you got to do that. It was like um, Van Gogh and Gauguin when they were roommates, where Gauguin had a better commercial eye for what was happening. 